Christmas greens, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Stone Sling and Giant Things, David and Goliath. Let's read. Israel's first king was named Saul. King Saul did not obey God. So God said to Samuel to the prophet, Find a man named Jesse. One of his sons will be the new king. So in yesterday's story, we saw Samuel. <coughs> Samuel became the prophet. And the king was the first, Israel first king was named Saul, but Saul didn't obey God, so God said, find a man Jesse, one of his sons will be the king. We found the Bible gem, David writes songs to God. Samuel found Jesse in Bethlehem. He looked at seven of Jesse's sons. They looked handsome and strong. Not then, God said, I don't care about looks. I care about what is in, the per in a person's heart. So Samuel found Jesse. Like, they were... Jesse's sons were very looking strong and handsome. But, but God said, not them. But they look very handsome and strong. But God didn't say that they are not not them. God said, God looks about what is in the person's heart, not looks. Jesse sent for his youngest, youngest son, David, who was tending sheep in the field. Samuel saw him, and God said, He is the one. So David was anointed, the king, the new king. So Jesse sent the youngest son. Like He was like just a little boy, and he was tending his sheep. So look, like, mm, you can see Samuel's face, like he's, mm, but God said he's the one. <coughs> They're all, like, God cares more about a person's look than what is in their heart. True? False? False was the correct answer. Sometime later, Israel found the Palestines. A giant Palestine soldier called Goliath challenged the Israel's to send a champion to fight him, but the Israelites were too afraid. So, sometime later, Israel, like, Palestines, a giant Palestine, Goliath, like, said, 
Gauntlet challenged the Israels to send a champion to fight with them, but they were all afraid to fight with the giant Goliath. Maybe he was three meters long. He ran dead. Question Who did God chose to be the king of Israel? Number one, David. Number two, maybe Jesse's first son. Number three, Jesse. Number one was the correct answer, David. David brought food to his brothers and army. <coughs> he heard Goliath's challenge and was not afraid. How dare you defeat the fairy god's army? asked David. I will fight him. So David brought food. One day, their brother were in the army. So one day David brought food because of his brother. He was really a little boy and he saw that Goliath was uh, telling not good things about God. God is like perfect, but Goliath was saying like that. So, like David was very angry with Goliath, so like he said, I will fight him. King Saul offered David his armor. No, said David, God help me kill the wild beast. He will help me against Goliath too. David took five stone and a sling. The King Saul offered the armor of his, but it was too big for David. So like, he didn't wear the armor and also the sword. He only took five stone and swing. We have found the Bible drum. I'm a dog, Goliath brought. You sent the sick of a boy to fight me. You have a spear, said David. But I have the help of Israel's God. So like, Goliath was laughing at David. So David said, you have a spirit, but I have the help of Israel God. David put a stone into a sling and threw it. It stuck Goliath's forehead and knocked him down. The Israel defeat the Palestine with God's help. David was a hero. So David put a stone in a sling and he threw it. Then like and knocked him down. It stuck on Goliath's forehead. They won the Palestine because of God's help. Yes, today a uh, question. God helped David kill Goliath the giant using five stone and sling. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy the next time I'll read uh, another good story? Then let's see you next time. Bye!